Hello everyone, and welcome back to our continued let's play of the Underworld's Cello. So, uh, yeah, now we're doing more Pick up the mayonnaise. Stuff. Do it. Okay, I'll, I'll pick up the mayonnaise again. Um, I'll just really pick up a bunch of crap I don't really need. I have no need for an outdated calendar. It had a date circuit. Oh, I'm sorry, that's me. Uh, it's a calendar. One of the days has been circled, and there's a word scrolled underneath it. It says birthday. Wait, this is last year's calendar. I wonder why they stopped flipping it over at that point in time. Wow. So, wait, this is on. Man, this, this house, the, it, like, it looks really old. But yeah. it's only like a year ago that it was abandoned or something. A apparently. That's weird. Also, what I was going to say about that being last... I mean, I, I see what she's saying. I don't know why they stopped flipping it over at that point. But to be fair, I think you kind of need a new calendar after that point. Oof. I think it's frozen shut. Right, but I should keep moving. Might be a pony, but you don't live in a barn. Close the door. Hey, oh, can shut you, uh, Can you not take anything else? No, I, I have a limited inventory space. I'm carrying too much stuff already. Yeah, it's six uh -oh. items at the most. Okay. And I mean, it's always amazing how the egg takes away just as much space as a giant pill. <laughs> <of happens. laughs> yeah, I know. Pot of spaghetti sauce sits simmering on the stove. Ah, that must be why the room smells so good. But, uh, this means at some point you've just been cooking here. I wonder where they went. Actually, better question. I wonder if I should be here when they get back. No. I'm not putting my hoofs in there. I use a spoon, thank you very much. I, I honestly wanted to turn it off, but okay. It doesn't even seem to have a hat to do. Carry it on. Size. I can't imagine that really big pan. What that really big pan is used for? Cooking re really big things, obviously. Obviously. Pan through the kitchenware. I had no idea that's how my life would pan out to be. <laughs> God damn it. As um, I just take the smallest one. You know, I wonder what I can do with this thing alone. Not very much, by the looks of it. However, there might be a way to make items more useful with the help of another tool. I think you just screwed me there. Oh, I get what you're trying to say. So I should try to be more inventive and combine certain things if I'm stuck somewhere. Yeah, I think you just broke yourself. Oops. You broke the game! <laughs> oh no! I broke the game! No, it's oh, fine. What? How does that even make sense? <laughs> I don't she know. She carries a tomato, but she can <laughs> carry a pen. <laughs> I'm not entirely certain either. I just know that apparently that fixed it. So, I yeah. I have the shit with us anyway. I don't know. I'm I'm gonna put on it unless I'm putting some of this back. Yeah, we might need the mayo. <laughs> I ca I can't help it. I need the mayo. Okay, so go go talk to Octavia. Yeah. I need to find it. It's a dumb waiter. Is it just dude? The poor thing can't the can't have the way it was made. There's no need for insults. <laughs> oh, indeed. As you approach the dumbwaiter, you can barely hear some voices echoing up the chute. Amongst the voices, you hear some pony very familiar, trying to sit up, stir up a crowd, and get them all to party. Oh my gosh, she is... You stick your head in and shout. Why no? Why no? For the love of all things, God in this world, please respond. Please tell me that you're okay. Yo, that you, Tavi? Friend is still alive and well. You feel great weight lifted off your shoulders upon hearing her voice. Finally, oh my gosh, I'm relieved that nothing serious happened to you. <laughs> oh yeah, that rug cushioned my fall. Thank goodness, too, because the last thing these ponies want is a dead DJ. What are you even doing down there? What ponies? There's a party being held down here with food, drinks, and guests all mingling about. 
You cannot be serious. I am, but the guests here look depressed. Like something horrible is gonna happen to them. After what I have witnessed up here, I do not blame them. No point in their white mind would be enjoying himself in this ghastly domain. Oh, uh, come on. It's, uh, it isn't so bad down here. Case in point. Look, can you leave the room and... Nope, you, the door is shut tight. Then I have no choice, Wanya. I'm going to head down where you are as soon as possible and set you all free. Aw, oh, yeah. Octavia's taking charge of this hizzy. Hey, if you want to talk about something or don't know what to do, come back to the, over to the dumbwaiter. He, er... Dumb, er, well, lay down some serious brainstorms. Sounds like a plan. Stay out, put, and keep me informed on what's going on down there. Cool, don't leave me hanging. I want. And then she's like, no! <laughs> <laughs> and then she immediately panics. I actually thought that would help our sanity. I she's also, too. I, I, I thought Looked I like did. it was. Yeah, it was looking like it was going to. Let's try to talk to her again and see if it, uh... I actually thought this looked like you could reset your sanity whenever you went here. Yeah. You? I hope Vine is doing okay down there. Final! Yo, I'm um, sorry. There, there. You tell me. Let's see. About myself. You want to hear what happened to me? Go for <laughs> it! <laughs> There's a voice in my head. Vine, I know it's going to sound strange, but I've got a voice in my head talking to me. Uh-oh. Does it tell you to burn things or something? Not as often as I should. <laughs> I'll be quiet. Whoa, chill out. I was just joking. What? No, no, no. I wasn't. That wasn't directed at you. So, who is this voice? Some pony you know? I'm afraid not. He insists on following me around the house for some reason. It's odd, I'm slightly comfortable with him. Even when he occasionally vice cracks. Cool, can I meet him? Hello, Vinyl. He said hi. Cool, okay, so listen, Octavia can be clumsy and snooty at times, so I think she needs all the help she can get. What, hey? Take care of her, okay? I'll try. She's going to make some worse, but we'll manage. Hmm, well, I'm deeply annoyed with both of you now. <laughs> uh, Girls are whispering into my ear. Isn't that the same thing? Well, let's try. I, oh, wait. No, I no, think those are the outside ghosts, not the Okay, ghosts. yeah, yeah. These ghosts will not stop fly filling my head with noise. Ghosts? Like actual ghosts? Cool! Not cool, Viner. I fear them trying to tear down my body and fish out my very soul. If I were them, I'd think twice about making you into a ghost. Your snobby attitude would haunt them for all eternity. Thank you for your sentiment, Viner. Should I waste away? I'd make an effort to haunt you. Ah, <laughs> uh, the dialogue's in this pretty good. Okay, maybe yeah, this'll I mean, help. The whole game is pretty much that up, but I feel yeah. like it. One of my favorite pony things. Right, exactly. I'm definitely looking forward to the full game release thing. And it's actually making pretty good progress from the looks of it. I mean, they have voice acting and stuff. Not as good as ours. <laughs> Not as amazing <laughs> as ours. I make such a good Tavio. Uh, wait, uh, jeez, why can't I names today? Like, I keep getting the, the characters mixed right. up. I left and right? It's a despair curse. We always get left and right mixed up. Oh, yeah. You get TFE, Octavia, and Vine Scratch mixed up. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Well, that's, that's fair. Oh, oh, I keep trying to shoot him, yeah. Do you know what about my little coping mechanism, right? How could I forget? Whenever you get really scared or nervous, you try to make yourself laugh. Smart, it goes. Whenever I look around the house, I sometimes make cheesy jokes or sheer my, to sheer myself up. Sometimes the voice in my head likes to encourage us by making bad puns or silly phrases of his own. Maybe you two should go on tour and be a famous comedy duo in Equestria. I don't think that would work. Nobody can hear his voice except for me. Actually, you don't know that. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. I think I'd be alright. Thanks for landing in here. No worries, now can you give it back? 
She looks very unpleased by that joke. <laughs> she does. She's like, fuck you, Ryder. When I fight you, I'm stabbing you. <laughs> I just, you don't, you don't get to make jokes like that, bitch. Okay, now about the party. Let's talk about the party, Yoin. I've definitely been in better parties than this. In my pants. <laughs> I'm sure I she. Know, that sounds like mine. <laughs> yeah, probably so. <laughs> uh, I've. I hope we do realize that this was not the party we were looking for. This is not the party. No, duh. It's not that hard to figure out. Well, actually, that's a lie. I actually thought the pitfall was one heck of a party entrance. When I saw the cupcake and punch, I thought we were going to have a cool time. But then the ponies said that I was another victim, and one pony shouted that this was the end of us all and curled up in the corner. Man, what a lame-o. That's when I realized that I was in one heck of a jam. Not the good kind, either. We have every right to be afraid, Wanda. It's not much pleasant up here, either. The whole house thinks of decay, haunting operations are trying to tear away my spirit. I found the severed head of one of the musicians that I toured around with in Equestria. You actually knew that, dude? Holy horse apples! You sure it wasn't a prop? I'm sure. Maggots were eating the head dead flesh even as we would speak. Okay, now I'm definitely sure this is the wrong party. What, you don't know me that place? <laughs> and how is it we found this house instead of the... <sighs> Simply put, I think there was a second house near the forest. Ah, uh, indeed. <laughs> Sorry about that. Fine, it does not take time for your sneezing. <laughs> Apparently not. Ah, uh, she, she gives no fucks. Who are the other ponies with you? There are four other ponies here. One's a bat pony, one's a milk delivery guy, one's a beekeeper, I think, and the other guy is a, well, a crazy starving guy. <laughs> <laughs> this is so good. Quite a variety of different guests. Question is, how when, how and when did I get here? Actually, what I'm like, kind of bad ponies fly up. That's actually what I was gonna say. It's so far only plot hole. Can't the bat pony just fly out? Uh, Maybe he swings to eat. I Maybe so. Actually, you didn't ask about who hosted the party. Oh, sorry. Um. I I I forgot. Do you know who's hosting this fake party? Hey, just forget this bad. No clue yet. I tried talking to the easily excited pony. The other guest says he's been here longer than the rest of us. But he won't respond to me. He's just quivering in a fetal position in the corner of the room. I'm simultaneously curious and horrified to know what malicious events he witnessed. Er, yeah, what you said. <laughs> then Octavia became an artist. <laughs> and not a musician kind either. Uh, Why kind? Indeed. I thought you were gonna say she became a serial killer, but sure. Are you okay? I don't care about it. How are you doing, Wayne? Are you well? Uh, I didn't know you cared. I don't. <laughs> I actually do. Yeah. Can you tell me about where you are exactly? Here's the rundown. We're in a tiny room below you. Behind me are some other ponies that I don't know. To my right is a hole I fell through. To my left is a steel door with no handle. Floor and walls are stone bricks. The air in here stinks a bit. There's no toilet or entertainment. Not even cards or a boombox. I see. So you and every pony I is living in a squalor. I'd hate to be in your position. Granted, I don't like my position. I'm currently in either. Let's see. Can you find a way out? Oh, well, the door is locked with no handle to open it. Guess we could try to climb out through the hole I fell through. I recommend against it. If you were to slip and fall, you might seriously injure yourself. Well, I guess all I can do is wait for you then. Thanks, Octavia. Don't mention it. Let's see. Do you need anything? Wait, did we already... 
I guess so. so. Anyway, oh, that was what you just asked. Okay. Do you need, Do you it? need anything? Well, since you asked, I'd like a large pineapple pizza with breadsticks and soda pop. A DJ booth to lay sweet jams while I wait. A couple of games for us to play with. A jacuzzi to chillax with my friends. And a back scratcher. Not for my back, but for a wicked itch I have on my butt. Why not? Please take this seriously. I am being serious. I'd like to have all of those things. I think you'd be alright for the moment. Well, can I at least have the back scratcher? I see what I can do. <laughs> You're the best, Tavi. Yeah. This <laughs> game makes me like Tavi Octavia. Fucking hell. <laughs> Tavi by the scratch shipping. What is this? It, it, indeed. Oh, it would be pretty good. Let's see. I need help with something. I need help with a problem up here. Lay it on me. The key and so ahead. There's a somewhat head on the table with a key in its mouth in a dining room. Ooh, that's twisted still. It could shouldn't hurt to get the key. I don't know about that. Sometimes I can hear it groan. Quick question. Do zombies exist? Given the evidence of the ghosts around me, I'd say there's a distinct possibility. Well, try grabbing the key without using your bare hooves. Okay, you could just, like, hit it with your fucking flying pan. I know, seriously. That's what I would do, like, boom, boom. Uh, that's a good way to make sure it won't get up. Oh, oops, that's... Yeah, tell me, so I want to leave. Nothing else. Thank you. Okay, then. Back to what I was doing. Back mm. to being crazy. Yeah, apparently vinyl scratch doesn't help our sanity meter. Ooh. Hey, this is new. This is new. Okay. Stay where you are, you eight like devil. We be on good terms with each other. Touch it. As you draw closer, it gives you a kiss on the hoof. Proclaims of its undying love, and the both of you end up living happily ever after in a two-story mansion with your 3,000 kids. Uh, take your overactive imagination and get out of here. <laughs> spiders. Fucking spiders is all over the place. Uh, it's a bottle of wine. It's already been opened. Hmm, good vintage. Perhaps a sit would help me calm down. Yes, do it. Drink the wine. So dead. Cup it down and get on your way. Oh no, I don't. One doesn't just pour wine down his throat. You have to savor it. First, you clear your mind. Swirl a bit of the wine at last. And observe the color. Watch as it gently laps against the side of the chalice. Take note of its legs and grace as it dances around your control. Then you close your eyes and smell the bouquet. Figure out the intricate scent and f flavors. Work out the subtle fragrances like a perfume infused with the essence of nature. Finally, the first sip. Put it in your mouth. Spread it over your tongue. Pick up the overtones and the undertones, the body and the balance. Then as you swallow, let the finish linger as it makes you... Want for the next drink. Jesus. Well, Vinyl usually finishes a bottle in about 15 seconds. She has her ways and I have mine, alright? <laughs> uh, very well then. With great finesse, you take that drink in the way you have just described. The entire process calms your stomach and eases your mind. The voices in your head begin to quiet down. Much better. Let's continue exploring. I didn't do much. <laughs> no, that didn't. I feel like this game just doesn't. I feel like nothing ever goes good. Yeah, I get I'm just wondering if that's a glitch. Well, I'm actually contemplating, um, because I am aware. I'm actually gonna click off the screen for a second so time doesn't continue. Oh, wait, no, I think I could click on the menu and that would make time. Yeah. Okay. But, um, anyways, I believe I read that the, um, current state of the demo is that the demo doesn't end. So I think what it is is it's kind of like one of those tri time trial demos. I think you just play... You always use you right. play as you can get. Yeah, okay. exactly. Bitch isn't very fine in our case. <laughs> yeah, it has not been. Uh... 
We'll, we'll probably keep trying until we get to the full extent of what we can do, but it, it'll probably take us a few goes, especially right, so the when you let's play, because you're always going to commentate, so you always slow down. Right, exactly. Ah, uh, he, he knew. He knew what he did, and, and then... Nah, he, he probably hates us. <laughs> I was going to say, he probably hates Let's Players, so was like, ah, I know just the way to screw over those bastards. Succeeded. Well, at least I got to beat my amazing wine thing. I don't like alcohol, but if someone wants to drink like that, and their name was Octavia, I wouldn't even complain. I know, seriously. That was a very fine way to drink. That was a very fancy way to drink. That was like, jeez. <laughs> that was like, respect. You win. Yeah, that was, that was respect for the drink. Alright, now let's see what else we got. What the fuck is this? It's, it's, Bread of it's, garlic uh, hangs from yeah. the top of the closet. Oh, okay. I knew that was garlic. Oh my! What I wouldn't give to have a plate of tortellini with like, some garlic bread right now. No, focus, Octavia. Survivor first, food later. <laughs> but you could just eat it. Garlic is amazing. Yeah. There's no take to. No need to take the butter. You just take one. All right. Let's see. What's this? Third word. Full of repair. I don't know. Sounds like something is slowing, but I think what? Let me read that again. Filla Rupa. Sounds like something is slurring barfly would say. <laughs> yeah. Slurring barfly makes sense. Don't know what that is. It's it's just like, you know, it's like someone who's like in a bar a lot and drinks a lot and stuff, you know. So basically know saying a drunkard or whatever. So the wine is scratch. <laughs> exactly. Some peppers have been strung together and have been hung up on the closet. Never liked spicy food. Wani knows this, but she always makes my food extra hot anyway. Perhaps you should give her the benefit of the doubt. It sounds like she's only trying to spice up your life. Sounds like you are only trying to redo. <laughs> That's quite enough out of you. Aww. I'm carrying too much stuff. Honestly, I, I, garlics are not that heavy. I know, I, I personally experience. <laughs> Garlic isn't particularly heavy, but, oh. Let's see if the kitchen cabinet, okay. You can eat that. Oh, right, let's put I some I mean, stuff like, back technically, we have already done this. Like, I believe I have no kind of the steps that we have to take. Right, right, yeah. We have indeed. Uh, we don't really, as far as I know, we don't need those things need for a bit, stuff. so, yeah, yeah. I don't think we ever used any of that. Yeah, we might summon this demo, but we haven't so far. It's a bag of unopened flour. I got an idea. Why right don't I put flour on myself? You look like a ghost. It's no fooling the dead. If you have a pulse, you aren't one of them. Never mind then. I think it's pretty heavy, but you take it. It might be useful if I want to make bread later. Who knows how long I'm staying here. <laughs> I mean, you could start making garlic bread. Indeed, exactly. Well, this hip tight and loose ends. Or we'll give you an end up being. S oh, fuck. I, I messed up that one. Something about being screwed, which I approve of. Exactly. I think this is the one that kills us. Yeah. Yes. Do I want to pull the way out? Maybe if I give a good tug, I can force it home. <laughs> you want to do it? Well, we've already done it. I, I think I'll, um. You need to oil it. That's why you need to use on it. Oh right, yeah. So let's just um do that. What am I thinking? What am I thinking? I I not do something. I, I maybe was there more to it? I don't know. I used to screw over. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. That's really weird. Okay. Remember you need to open it, and then you open... I don't remember. Put um, away the flower. Huh? Put away the flower. Okay. Oh no, I'm gonna die soon. No, use the wooden ladle on the soup. On the... Oh, okay. Jeez, no. Uh... No, actually, no, wait. Use the wooden ladle, um, combine it with a pan. Now go to the um fourth. Oh right, yeah, I remember that. 
Die, beastie. Ah, no. There's a phrase around these parts. Let the sleeping wolves lie. And Porcher decided to ignore such sage advice. You must now plan your next few actions accordingly. If you don't have such a plan in mind, I suggest you beat a hasty retreat. I oh, like you, beast. Have some of this. <laughs> the plan works. The timber wolf starts to rear back with its tail between its legs. You approach the key, playing your music along with the way. Once you get with within reach, you throw your instrument down the final crash and snatch up your prize, rushing away from the wolf before it can recover. Okay, we said you open the thing. Yeah. Ooh, I dropped the pan and spoon, but at least I got away. I hope this key was worth the trouble. The timber wolf can, yeah. Okay, now you go to the left. Then up there. Then open that. And try to get as far as we can before we die. Right. Opens. Key breaks off. Don't worry, though. You won't be needing it any longer. Then you grab the stuff. Yeah. Oh, no. Well, I'm not sure if I'll be able to put this to good use, but I suppose the wrench is always something convenient to have a place like these, and places like these. Let's just pick this up. Okay, you sat on the thing then. Yeah. That took some effort, but I refit all I can without making a mess. So much for the container, though. All empty. Oh, well. This will suffice. Yeah, there we go. Not much except here, nails, except nails and boards. Okay, uh, now you can use that on the door handle to open it. Right, exactly. Okay, boom. Not I'm not going to even try. But then go okay. suddenly. I thought that was how you did it. <clears throat> hmm. No, I'm not entirely sure. It's not. Okay, let's try that. Leave it alone, and then maybe. No. no? Okay. Um, can you use the bench to get the key? Wrench to get the key. Oh, from the uh, thing. Let's try. Wrench it. Tempt to use the item to loosen the key, but despite your best efforts, the key is still stuck inside his mouth. Plus, I think I need something with a better grip. Yeah, you need the thing. But you can't get that thing. Because you need to open the door. Go left. Look inside the plate thingy. Alright, I think we couldn't. Oh, we can't open that. Yeah, it's locked tight. Okay. That's what I was thinking. Alright, so, um. Man, we're gonna die soon. Yep. Okay, it's a rule still there, right? You can ask Vinyl. Yeah, hey Vinyl. Why don't you recover our sanity meter? Go to the doors. The keys. No, okay, it's the. She sees it. Yeah. <laughs> what a useless bitch. What a steep bitch. Okay, try using. I don't know, like, I feel like that pot is relevant, but I don't remember ever doing anything with it. Oh. No! <laughs> Alright, well, I'll get us caught up and we'll figure out what we're doing next time, so thank you all for watching, and we will see you indeed next time. Take care.